Bengals suck. They will fumble. Take it to the bank. They're getting ready for the script. Bengals suck. Bengals, third war sacks in the league. Bungholes, third war sacks in the league. What company? The Jets, the Panthers, the Bears, the Bungles offensive line sucks! And they will feel the pressure of the Rita invasion this week. The 56 sack allowed in the season to the Vegas Raiders. The former Raven Yannick Nagakiewie gets the pressure on the former division rival. On 15-1, on the 15th day of the first month, all going to be in tribute to Jim Plunkett. Mad Max. Max Crosby puts the pressure on these guys. 6-2, the Raiders will be since they lost to the Bengals and Joseph Burrow. Carl Nassib will help the Raiders win their first playoff game in 19 years for the Raiders' 19th game as the Vegas, for their 19th win as the Vegas Raiders, because it's Bo Jackson that's Jamachi at 19, it's Mark Davis, it's Davis that's <coughs> Jamachi at 19. It is Bo Jackson that never played again after he hurt his hip in the 1991 playoff game against the Bungles. The Bungles will allow five sacks. They will allow 59 sacks. Oakland's Jamacha 58. Fumbles Jamacha 59. The, the Bungles are getting ready to fumble, everybody. They're getting ready to fumble. The, Illum the Illuminati puts it right in front of your eyes. The score is tied at 32 before the Raiders won in overtime against the Chargers. The Bengals are not winning in the playoffs. The, the playoff win streak... The playoff win drought doesn't end for the Bungles. It ends for the Raiders. The Raiders are owed a championship for the Bungles, prematurely ending the career of Bo Jackson. The curse of Bo Jackson does not end until the Raiders win the Super Bowl. Period! Period! Because the Bungles won't win the playoff game again until 32 years later. These are the facts. And they're throwing it right in front of your face. The Cincinnati Bengals scored 32 points in that red scripted game against the Raiders. This is a hoax outing. And they're getting ready for this. They're getting ready for the fumbles on the Bungles. The very, very first series, Burrow is sacked. He loses the ball, fumbles, Nigakao EA forces the pressure. Leave it, recovers the ball, and he races all the way to the Cincinnati 9. First and goal from the 9-yard line. A lot like the Raiders ending a 19-year playoff win spell for their 19th win as the Vegas Raiders. It is all but a done deal. The Illuminati was throwing this right in front of your face as he's number 32. It shows you that the Raiders are far superior than the Bungles. They're putting pressure on the Bungles all game long. The Bungles couldn't do anything against the Raiders. The Raiders were not allowed to score the touchdown. The Raiders were not allowed to win the game because the Mafia wants you to think all oh, the Raiders suck. The Bengals so much better. They're already getting ready for y'all this week with the Bengals win against the Kansas City Chiefs. Ain't that fooling nobody it as the Raiders own the Bungos. They own these guys. We all knew the Raiders stopped trying after they got the fumble on the Bungos. They're getting ready for the wild card script. Number 32 gets the fumble. This is what really should have happened. That regular season game was a hoax to get you to think the Bengals are going to win, but the Raiders are really the better team between all of them. You need to see the Raiders win the Super Bowl for the first time since Marcus Allen, number 32, won Super Bowl MVP. Again, the Raiders win the Super Bowl, and the Bengals do not win a playoff game until 32 years later. Because as we have discussed, Tigers, Jamacha 32. It is, it is, it is, it is NFL that has Jamacha 32. 
It's Jim Plunkett that has to watch at 32. Jim Plunkett, read us all the way. Marvin Lewis says he wants a playoff win, but ah, uh, not happening. Marvin's Demacia 32, and Fresno, where Carr went to school, is Demacia 32. It's Denver, the first game with Passaccia, that's Demacia 32. The Raiders were 3-2 and two when John Gooden resigned. You see that? The Illuminati puts it right in front of all of your faces. For the all C and I of the Illuminati and the fierce shield of the Rita is the Rothschild Red Shield. You got the fierce shield of the Rita's loco. Derek Carr threw 19 attempt passing completions in this game. Look at that. 19 year playoff win drought ends. The Raiders win. The Illuminati showing this all the way that. The Raiders are going to scoop up turnovers. They're going to kick the Bengals in the ass in the cold weather. It's going to be so epic what it does happen with this weak-ass offensive line. Because you see there, that's called football. You see there, Bengals secondary, suck. Bengals suck, period. You pick the Bengals over the wooden tradition of the Raiders. The Illuminati really mocking all the sheep. Say, bingo, 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 bingo. You went and got greater as giving you any good reason to believe that the Bungles are going to do anything different in the playoffs. And not once, but seven, eight straight times they've lost in the playoffs. Really? Really? What good reason is there to pick these guys? The way the invasion going to kick their own ass. They're going to kick him to the fucking curb all the fucking way. They throw it in front of your face. It's there for the tanking. The radio invasion.